Hey, it's Javier the X-Man right here from Magic Knight 2.5 San Diego's Old School doing it all the way live. Cyberspace is scraping on LowridingTV.com. Hey, Cyber Scrapers, Mark Aragon with LowridingTV.com, and today we're at Qualcomm Stadium in San Diego, California for the 2010 Lowrider Car Show Experience put on by our friends at ODB Entertainment. I caught up with Toro Jimenez, editor-in-chief of Impala's magazine. Toro, thanks for stopping by and chatting with uh, us, man. Thanks for coming by and, you know, being a part of this yourselves. Absolutely. Tell us a little bit about the history of Impala's magazine. Uh, the history of Impala's magazine, it goes back about two years. Um, you know, I've, I've worked for several magazines and my partner, Mark, he had Impala's wear and, you know, we kept kind of clicking together and we decided to kind of, you know, make a partnership and what you have after a couple months of, of working together is Impala's magazine. Um, and we've been around for about a year and a half. And, and we've kind of taken these steps to where a, a lot of other magazines, I think, haven't had the same opportunity and, and we're, we're being a, a big part of the community. Um, the, the, the lowrider culture, the, the street rod culture, the, the, you know, just everything that's out there from dub to lowrider to, you know, everything else that you see out there, not just the lowrider style. Mm -hmm. um, the, the cars that we feature are Impalas. We do the layouts with them. But it's not just a low rider style. We do what's called a low rod, which is like the 20 inch wheels. We do the radicals, the originals, um, everything in between. And, and we do it in a kind of a different way where not each, you know, there's not just one centerfold. Each, there, each car has a two page spread. We do four to six pages of coverage on each car, pretty much giving everybody what's due to them. I mean, it's, it's, it's kind of hard, you know, you see features where it's just one or two pages and there's just so much to the cars. I mean, we have the low rider of the year and there's no way you can just do that in two pages. So that's one thing we take pride in is not just our photography, but the quality of it, the amount of, of photos we put in there for each car. And say if you're on the East Coast, if you're on the Northern California, if you're in Arizona, if you're in Texas, when you pick up the magazine, you know you get that feel for that car. And, and that's one thing that we're taking pride in. And um, you just started going we just got a distributor out in, in uh, New, uh, Australia so we're, we're going down there it's getting sent out of Japan it's going up to Canada so yeah in about a year and a half we've gone I guess you can say international you know we've shot at West Coast Customs um, we've done a couple of things we came on living the low life uh, you know we came out on that a couple of times uh, they did us for the Impala's episode and a couple of the other things that was a, a pretty good experience and that's just a way of, of just reaching out to everybody out there that Certain people, there's people that have a certain stereotype about this, and we're here to kind of take that away. I mean, you, what you look or you see around here, families, you know, you see parents, you see kids walking around, you see the, the guys out there, the girls walking out there in groups, and there's something out there for everybody, and that's what Impala's magazine is all about. You know, even though we're just Impala's, we're trying to cater to a lot of the world out there. Excellent, and also welcome to cyberspace because you're on LowridingTV.com right, now thank as well. You for so. the opportunity. Absolutely. Yeah. Man. All right, all right, yeah, cool. all right folks. We're keeping it real in San Diego right here. The kickoff tour, the Lowrider Experience 2010. Impala's Magazine. Check them out.